coffee and coffee-related drinks in Italy are full of do's and don't. Now, let's see what are the big no for our way of enjoying coffee. First and foremost, there is no to-go coffee. Are you crazy? Why would you want a coffee? To you just take yourself to the bar to get the coffee and go elsewhere. It doesn't make any sense. Where do you have to go that you gotta hold your coffee and you're so rushing? Just don't do it. Another big, big no, this is actually really frowned upon in Italy, is cappuccino after breakfast time. Seriously, why would you want a hot glass of frothy milk with a shot of espresso inside at 10 o'clock at night right before you go to bed? That is it's just weird to me. Please don't do it. Now, as far as espresso, since we're talking about late night, early morning, espresso, espresso is 24-7, 365. There is not the right or the wrong time to enjoy an espresso. Now, if an espresso or a ristretto, which is a very short, it's like one shot, it's too strong for you, instead of drink like dishwasher water, which is an American coffee, and that's not good, you gotta get a caffè lungo. Caffè lungo is like a coffee, it's like a ristretto, but lungo, taller, because there is more water in it. At least you still get the good feeling and flavor of a roasted espresso without the strength of one shooter. Now, the problem you're gonna have when you go at the bar and you order a, something like a latte. Everybody loves a latte. Can I have a latte? I see it at the bar all the time. Can I have a latte? And the barista does a latte, put all kinds of things in it. In Italy, if you order a latte, you're gonna get one glass of milk, probably cold, because that's what you asked. There is no latte drink. What you can have, like in this case, it's a latte macchiato. Macchiato with a shot of espresso. So you get your shot of espresso and you dump it into the latte. Now this, it's a, an Italian, coffee drink called latte macchiato. Now, if you're like me, that you're into liquor more than you are into milk, you can get a caffè corretto, which is a shot of espresso with a little bit of booze inside. What else is left out? Ha, ah, decaf. I hate decaf, I just don't like decaf. I wouldn't say I hate it, but let's be honest. It tastes just like a normal coffee, but it doesn't have the energizing power and the the wake up effect that a regular espresso have, and that's the reason why most people drink espresso, because they want to get, you know, a little shaken up. Now please, quit cappuccinos after 10 a.m., stop taking stuff to go, and enjoy espresso a little bit more often.